Okay, Michael, so uh, we're climbing the last few stairs towards level three. Um, as Rachel, <laughs> this is now, this is the fire escape area. Obviously very grey and blurry. Right, so this, a bit of a mess, but this is going to be a sort of reception room um, for briefing and um, waiting for the game to start. Um, walking into tomb room or the plague room. Um, as you can see, it's sort of overlooking the church and the graveyard, which is really nice. Um, the holes for a sliding door. That hole there is for a of puzzles. Um, again, it's getting a bit dark and gloomy, but there's another compartment here. Fireplace. And there's a tunnel. So I'm going to attempt to bend down and get through. So this is the medieval room um, and then middle room is storage too dark to see uh, and now we're heading into the room which is going to be Armageddon. We're going to have a steel door there with sort of wheel wheels to turn the lock. Um, so I'm going to get into a corner. Rachel again, the ghost following me. <laughs> this is a big sliding door affair. This is going to be sort of all painted concrete like a bunker. Um, got a bit more cladding to do on these walls. Um, and it goes around the corner into there. This is all going to be full of sort of rockets and switches and things like that. Um, we've got a toilet in there, and a sink. Rachel's been cleaning that up. And you're going to open the control room door. Got nice. Trying to keep as much of the original droppiness. So, we've got benches in the control room. And we're going to try and put some windows on the side walls to let some natural light in. So it looks a bit like a prison cell. So that's the grand tour. Um,